We've laughed with you, we've cried with you, but most of all, we've fallen in love with you. Caroline Flack was synonymous with ITV's hit reality show, Love Island. As its host for five series, she became one of the most popular personalities on TV. But the 40-year-old was today found dead at her home in East London. Her family's lawyer has confirmed that she took her own life. In a statement, they said, we can confirm that our Caroline passed away today, the 15th of February. We would ask that the press respect the privacy of the family at this difficult time. Caroline Flack co-hosted The X Factor and won a series of Strictly Come Dancing Caroline! before becoming Love Island's presenter in 2015. She stepped down from that role at the end of last year after she was charged with assaulting her partner. She appeared in court in December to enter a not guilty plea. Her boyfriend, tennis player and model Lewis Burton, had said he wanted the case against her to be dropped, but it wasn't and her trial was due to go ahead next month. Tonight, Caroline Flack's management team criticised prosecutors for what they described as a show trial. As part of her bail conditions, Caroline Flack was told not to contact her boyfriend. She posted a message on Instagram just before Christmas saying, this kind of scrutiny and speculation is a lot to take on for one person to take on their own. Tonight, there was an outpouring of emotion on social media as people reacted to news of her death. Fellow ITV presenters Anton Deck said on Twitter, it is beyond sad, beyond words, so tragic. Caroline's friend and replacement as host on Love Island wrote, I'm trying to find the words, but I can't. And Philip Schofield shared a post on Instagram which read, you poor, poor darling girl, my heart is breaking. And repeating Caroline's own words from an earlier post, be kind. Tonight, the first flowers were left on the pavement outside Caroline Flack's former home as family, friends and fans begin to express their shock.